Hey everybody. Welcome. Hello. Hola. Ciao. Salut. Good to see you all. There you all are. I see you starting to, to join in. Welcome. You have stumbled into the Mika Fan Club Instagram Live, um, our almost weekly gathering here of Mika fans. Um, for those of you who don't know me, I am Deb, the administrator of MikaFanClub.com, our website. Uh, so welcome to everybody who's here and who's uh, joining us right now. I see, salut Camille, hi Ina, salut Fanny, hi Andrea, salut Laurie, hi Anik, Angela, hi, how are you, ciao Chiara. Hi Anna, hi Suzanne, hi Pascal, hi Daphne, ciao Sylvia, did I say that already, did I say hi, <laughs> ciao, uh, salut Gulden, I'll get your name right one day, I'll say it properly one day, <laughs> ciao Veronica, hi Maria, hello Isa, good to see you all, I'm glad you're all here. How are you all doing this week? Um, we're just a week before Christmas. For those of you who celebrate Christmas, are you feeling uh, frantic because the holiday is nearly here? Have you done all of your Christmas preparations, all of your holiday baking and shopping and gift wrapping and that sort of thing? I definitely haven't. I am really, really late this year with everything. Um, so, uh, yeah, I really probably shouldn't even take the time to do this. I should be doing something uh, Christmas-related to get ready. But here I am. I am uh, happy to see you all. And uh, we have a lot to talk about today, so I will just sort of dive right in. First of all, I'll say happy birthday to anybody who's celebrating. Happy anniversary uh, to anybody celebrating any milestones. Um, I hope you all have a good day. Uh, chance to get together with family and friends and celebrate. Um, and yeah, I thought uh, we have a lot of news this week, so we should get right to it. I am, I see that I am freezing occasionally here, so I, I hope it doesn't get much worse than that, uh, so that we can bring some of you in to um, hear about your uh, experiences last weekend um, at VARS and uh, maybe talk a little bit about uh, Mika's upcoming tour that he announced just the other day and uh, the ticket pre-sales that are going on right now as we speak um, for those North American dates and for the London date that he announced. Um, so I'll get to all of that. Uh, I'll start with uh, the Mika fan club news. As I said, uh, you may have heard that uh, Mika is going to be do doing yesterday. He announced uh, six dates in North America and uh, also a London date. Uh, the London date is for July, so it's a little bit uh, in the future, but uh, ticket pre sales, uh, tickets went on pre sale today uh, for fan club members. And um, if you're planning on going to any of those dates, uh, I hope you take advantage of the ticket pre-sale. There's lots of seats um, still available, but a lot gone already. And it's uh, it's been kind of cool to watch the maps of the different venues um, shrinking as the seats have gotten snapped up. I know I had trouble myself trying to buy tickets for the Brooklyn show because every time I went to buy seats, I got the message, oops. Uh, those seats are gone already. Somebody else got them, <laughs> and I was getting a little frustrated at that, uh, but I did finally manage to get some seats. I hope that if you were looking for tickets, you all found yours as well. Uh, for those of you who maybe didn't know about the tickets or about the tour um, or about the pre-sale, um, as I said, the London date right now is the only date we know of um, that's in Europe or, or the UK. Uh, it is for July 3rd in London, 
and as I said, the uh, pre-sale started today. Uh, the dates in North America are uh, in April, and they start with um, April 3rd in Boston, and then they go every other day uh, for 10 days or so. It's April 3rd in Boston, April 5th, April 7th in, I have to cheat because I can't remember which one comes next. It's uh, Quebec on April 7th, it's Montreal on April 9th, it's Sag Saguenay in um, Canada on April 11th, and then Toronto on April 13th. Um, those are the dates we have so far. When Mika made the announcement yesterday, he said that there were more dates coming, um, so we should um, stay tuned. But these are the dates we have had confirmed so far. And um, if you're interested and you haven't bought your tickets yet, they are on pre-sale right now. We have all the links with the pre-sale code on our website, on MikaFanClub.com. So you can go over there and find it. It's pretty easy and you can just click through to the uh, ticket purchase links and uh, snap up your tickets. Um, I hope I'll be seeing a lot of you at some of the concerts and um, I'm really looking forward to it. It uh, feels like a move toward uh, normality, doesn't it? Um, it is a great week. Uh, that now that we know there is a tour coming, right? It makes 2022 even more attractive. Um, I was really ready for the new year before, but now I am super excited for it. I am sorry that I keep freezing. I see that uh, I see that I do. Um, yes, Christmas is just in one week. Um, it's a week from. Uh, well, Christmas Eve is a week from Friday, and uh, I guess Christmas Day is a week from Saturday. Uh, so I am starting to freak out a little bit. Um, how excited am I? How excited am I for the concerts? Very excited, um, especially because they're going to be on this side of the world, um, and I'll be able to go to a couple. <laughs> so, and you know that more dates are coming, so... Those of you in Europe uh, should not despair. Um, I don't know where else the tour might be going, but I feel sure that there will be more festival dates um, this summer, and uh, I hope there will be more dates for uh, regular shows uh, as well. Um, so yes, there's my little Santa hat. It's my one little Christmas decoration I have down here. Um, I also have a little Mika Christmas tree, whoops, right there. Thanks to Anna, and the very lovely and talented um, Anna who likes to do crafty things, which I am not good at, um, but we have, so we have Christmas Mika there. Um, that's about as ready and as decorated as I am for Christmas. Well, that's not true. I do have my Christmas tree up, which um, you might have seen. I posted a, a little video of it on my other, on my personal Instagram account. Um, yes, the Mika concerts are the greatest Christmas gift. They were a big surprise, weren't they? Uh, I was hoping, but didn't really expect them. It was great. Um, surprise announcement. I did wake up very early. I woke up early two days in a row, Camille, <laughs> to get ready for all of this. Um, and uh, not only to buy my own tickets today, but also to answer any questions and, and deal with any issues that might pop up. So um, it worked out really well. We had a little minor glitch with the, the London um, pre-sale this morning. We had the wrong link, but once we got the right link, everything went smoothly, I think. Um, and I hope I'm going to see a lot of you there in London in July, <laughs> which is a long ways off still. Um, so uh, let's see, what else here? Uh, oh, I see a lot of you have your tickets for London. That's great. Uh, hi, Tara. I didn't see you there before. Um, hi to Michelle and to Michelle. See both of you there. Um, hi, Chloe. 
how Chloe got her ticket too. Chloe is a longtime Mika fan. I remember her on Mika Fan Club from way back. Um, not that she's old, but she was young then. <laughs> so, let's see. Oh, hi. Uh, there's another Michelle. Hi, Sabina. And um, Manxi. Hi. I don't recognize that name. Welcome. Uh, got your Toronto tickets. Good. I'm glad to see that. Yeah, the, the pre-sale does help a lot because you know you're at least going to get tickets, right? You're not going to be shut out altogether. Um, so, yeah, it was nice uh, that Mika's team organized that. And uh, it really, um, it, it has gone, I think, pretty smoothly. And it does make it a little bit uh, less stressful. It is always stressful to buy tickets, though, isn't it? I mean, you get so worked up, especially if it's a seated gig and you want to get good seats and... Um, I know I was stressing out myself, so, um, but yeah, so many dates, um, hopefully more. Uh, we have to do a cruise on the Thames for London, Karen says. That is a great idea. Um, and it will be July, so it will be warm enough. Um, that's a great idea. We'll, we'll look into that and we'll see. Uh, we'll see if that's, uh, possible. Um, that would be cool. That would be an interesting tradition to have the MSC tour boat hit London as well, too. Um, what tickets did I buy? Um, I bought tickets for London and for New York and um, Montreal. And um, I think I might go to Toronto as well. It depends on the timing. Um, and then I'm going to wait and see what else um, gets announced. Hopefully uh, some other dates in the U.S. will be announced. Uh, maybe some a little closer to me. Um, because right now everything is a plane right away. And it can get pretty expensive pretty quickly, right? Um, uh, yeah, happy birthday to Angela. I guess it was her birthday and... And Mika's announcement was one of her birthday presents, right? Um, so, yeah, happy birthday for, <laughs> for that. Um, let's see here. Hi, Eric. I didn't see you there before. Hi, Lulu. Hi, Lisa. Hi, Cecilia. Good to see you all. Uh, Karen says she thinks Germany won't be in the among the tour dates. Well, um, it hasn't been lately, so I don't know. Um, we'll find out soon. I hope. Um, anxious to see uh, where where else we're gonna um, have some have some tour dates. Um, hi, Savan. Fresh Princess of Northborough, your boyfriend is getting you tickets. That's great. Good. For which gig? Which, uh, which show? London? Um, um, do I think Mika will release an album? Um, eventually. Um, I think he will. Um, he's definitely working on new music. Um, as he has hinted more than once um, in his Instagram stories. So, yeah, I think he will eventually release an album, or at least uh, some new music in, in some format. Uh, I hope we're going to get some soon. Uh, hi, Engie. Hi, how are you? No lightning outside. Oh, I, I do have... Um, my husband did put lights out... Um, the other day, he did put the lights out. You're right. Good memory. <laughs> yeah, we do. Um, but he's a little more organized than I am. He's He's been doing some things. I, I like don't have any baking done, and I don't have any Christmas presents bought. And bad, bad mom and uh, bad daughter. <laughs> Haven't bought anything yet. Um, let's see here. 
Hi, Rose. Did I say hi to you? Um, I'm going to Brooklyn. I will be there. Hi, Katia. Katia from Paris. My, I think my comments are lagging behind here because I see lots of... I'm freezing as well. I'm sorry about that. Oh, hi, Zita. Zita's here. Hi. And, and Guy is here. Hi. And let's see, what else did I want to tell you? Um, I talked about the pre-sales. Um, next week, um, I thought we would do uh, celebrate Christmas two ways. Uh, have a Christmas Zoom meeting on Sunday and then do a regular Instagram Live but I think we'll do it on Tuesday because on Wednesday, I believe Mika's Paris concert is going to be um, airing on, and I can't remember now if it's French TV first and then Italian TV. I think it's going to be on French TV. So I don't want to conflict with that. So I think um, we'll do our Instagram Live on Tuesday next week. Uh, and just get together for a last um, Merry Christmas wish to everybody uh, before the holidays. Um, and I'll mention that in our Instagram stories, but just so you know in advance, I think the Zoom will be on Sunday for Christmas and the Instagram Live will be on Tuesday next week for Christmas or the holidays because uh, New Year's is coming up right behind it too. So. Uh, so I did want to tell you about that. We've talked about Mika's tour um, and also about London, um, that more dates are coming. And uh, as I said, we talked about this a little bit last week, that the symphonic concerts that Mika gave in Paris um, at the end of October, uh, the first night of those concerts is going to be broadcast on French TV on December 20th. And then I believe it's going to be on Italian TV on the 24th and the 25th. And Mika just posted about that in his um, Instagram account, and I reposted it. Um, and I'm sorry, I don't remember the specific uh, times and, and channels. So please refer to um, our Instagram post. Um, I am a little bit tired <laughs> today, so... Um, but yes, um, if for those of you in Italy and France, you should be able to see the symphonic concert um, broadcast. Um, I'm hoping that it will be streaming um, in a way that we'll be able to see it um, for those of us outside of the um, outside of those countries. Um, Wow, yeah, my comments must be really lagging here. Let me see if I can. So let me see if I can catch up here. Because it does seem like there's a lot here now suddenly scrolling up. Um, okay, here we are. I think I'm caught up now. And then I froze again. <laughs> Sorry. Um, Chloe asked why Mika only has one UK date. Um, I don't know. I really, and I can't even begin to guess why because I know he's still, you know, very popular. A lot of people always are asking about why he doesn't do more dates in, in the UK. So I, I don't know. Um, some of it must be scheduling, but I don't know. Um, Okay, some of you are asking about paying for the tickets and, and PayPal. I believe that they were accepting PayPal um, on the um, Ticketmaster site for the London gig, if that's what you're asking about. Um, and I think they were taking some other alternative forms of payment. There was something called Klarna. I don't know what that is because um, it's a, I think it's a European thing. Um, but I think they were taking debit cards as well, not just credit cards. So there are, I think, alternative ways to pay on the website. Um, we will take a we'll look at it and see if we can find out exactly um, what other methods you might have. Um, 
would Mika do a digital album like he did for the Versailles concert? Um, that's a possibility. Um, I think sometimes a lot of that has to do with rights and, um, you know, getting permissions. Um, since Mika performed with the symphony, he would need the, you know, the permission of the symph the symphony members, and then there was a choir involved, so they would need the permission from all the choir members, and I think sometimes that gets kind of complicated, and that's why we maybe don't get the the recordings when we would like to. Um, not always the control to just say, okay, we're going to do we're going to do a recording or we're going to release a digital a streaming album or something. So, um, but we can hope. I mean, I would, I would love to have it that way. And since they're doing it um, as a TV broadcast, maybe, maybe that is something that we can expect in the future. We'll see. Um, and now it's not my, I'm just not scrolling. It's not that, it's not like they're, the comments are lagging. <laughs> it's, it's like they're, they're just not scrolling. They're just like there. And then I have to go and, and um, actually scroll. Um, Klarna is like buy now, pay later. Well, that's kind of like a credit card, right? Um, Unfortunately, I don't speak French, and uh, je ne parle pas français, um, so I can't, um, I, I can't really, I'm working on it, but okay, um, so anyhow, let's see. Um, and I told you about the, the tour dates, and uh, we talked about the TV broadcast, and Mika has been in the studio now that he's done with X Factor. Um, I think, uh, you know, he'll have some more time to breathe and, and maybe concentrate on that a little bit more. And, um, of course, you know, he'll probably be celebrating the holidays too, taking some time off around the holidays. But hopefully, um, we will be able to get some, some new music soon. Um, and find out more about the future tour um, as well. So with all of that said, I think I've babbled on enough, and I know a number of you got to see Mika this past weekend um, at, in the Alps um, at uh, the resort in, is it Vars? And um, it looked like it was a great show, and... I know a lot of you would like to share what you saw and experienced there, so I'm going to see if uh, technology will allow me to bring you in uh, so we can have a conversation. And I'm going to try to bring in several people at once um, at the risk of screwing things up, so we'll see how that goes. Uh, and we'll see, we'll see how it goes, all right? So, um, yeah. <laughs> we'll, we'll give it a try anyhow. Um, I'm going to try. Let's see. Um, Fanny. Fanny. It's, I don't know. It keeps, oh, there you are. Ah, there she is. Hi. Coucou. <laughs> Salut tout le monde. Hi, everybody. How are you? I'm fine. Ah, she's got a poster. <laughs> this is my poster. poster, yeah. <laughs> I'm very happy to have it. It's very nice. <laughs> very nice. It was, um, it was a very expedition. <laughs> <laughs> I guess you had quite an adventure. Yeah. <laughs> can, you, can you bring Gildan with us? I, I can if she if is... If technology here. is good. If that's right, and if she is agreeable, let me see here. Because uh, she was with me with for the expedition. <laughs> that's the world. Okay, well, let me see if I can find her here. If it's possible. Yeah, if I can find her, um, oh. I should be able to add her. Um, Technology. <laughs> I know. I can't. 
Let me see. No, you can't. Oh. No. Not no. I thought I could do it there. Oh, here, maybe here. Here we go. This might be it. (laughs) There she is. Let's see. She is okay. Oh. (laughs) I don't know. No. Mm, Oh. Oh. Yes. It's good. Is she there? There Yes, she is. is. (laughs) Salut, Gugu. Hello, hello, everybody. (laughs) So, how are you, Deb? I am well, and I am anxious to hear. I I understand you had uh, you drove through an avalanche. Yes. To see, <laughs> yes. To get to see Mika. Dis bonjour. bonjour. And you had. Uh, <laughs> Salut, <laughs> Thea. <laughs> Envoie un bisou. <laughs> <laughs> yes, an avalanche. Yeah. Yes. We and we were had... um, we went locked uh, on the on the road with the snow. And you had to change your tires? Uh, no, it, it was good, but we 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 must wait. Um, uh, Gugu, à toi, <laughs> parle en anglais. <laughs> uh, we have to wait, uh, wait. because uh, of the avalanche. Wait. There was a queue with many cars, ah. so we thought we were thinking that. Maybe we will have to go back yes. to art. Maybe our we, home be, we will be and cancel the, the concert yes. oh, and, yeah. uh, and go back at home without seeing Mika. Oh, no, no. No, no. <laughs> and we have um, a lot of snow, snow on the road, and uh, we must uh, to put some chains, chains on the. On the. Come on. Tire. Yeah. yeah. Tire. So, Gugu and me are very, very good for, for putting. <laughs> oh my you are, God! You are very brave. Oh, we 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 didn't be ready, <laughs> but um, we we have uh, we have done with um, um, a little boy, which um, which has put the chain for us. So ah. after a young man, a young man, not a little boy, a young man. A young man, a young man, sorry. <laughs> yeah, and after we 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 arrive, we are um we come uh, good. Good. It was good. <laughs> and you and you got there and then you met up with um a group of others and you had dinner. Yeah. Yeah, and the, the evening uh, the evening Italian, Italian fan, fan. <laughs> and we we hit together. It was a very nice moment. Nice. And we prepared. We we have prepared prepared um, a gift for Mika. Right. Uh, for me, it was the first time I do a gift. Even if I'm fan since the beginning, I haven't done a big gift. It was the first time, so I was okay. very happy. Because uh, I am very lucky, I can give the um, the gift him, uh, to to him to him. I have uh, seen Mika and I give the the gift. Ah, you gave it to him in person. Yeah, yeah. Ah. It was it was. Uh, I was very lucky. Huh? It was a good timing. <laughs> good. <laughs> <laughs> with well, uh, with the other fans, there is Ina too and uh, Michelle. Aha. Uh-huh. And, and Mika says thank, thank you very much to to be there. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> because Mika uh, has really um, really cold too. <laughs> I guess so. Was he surprised to see so many of you there? Yeah, I think. Uh, yeah. And um, we are, we are very lucky because we have seen uh, two two concerts finally, because we have uh, we have seen. Uh, uh, the um, sun, sun, sun check. Check. Voilà. Merci. <laughs> um, at, at the beginning, Mika wasn't there, so we didn't think he, co- he came for the the balance. Mm-hmm. And when uh, we have seen it, it was a very good surprise. I I was lucky to see some of you did. Uh live streams from the sound check and i got yeah. to see a few minutes of that and that was a nice treat very nice treat yeah. 
though. <laughs> but cold. It looked very, very cold. Yes. I told you. How long were you outside? Were you waiting? From uh, 8 a.m. But uh, we have uh, we had had the lunch. Okay. So and we we walk a bit and we come back and at uh, 4 p.m. we were doing the queue. Okay. <laughs> oh wow. But uh, for uh, for the cold, it really it was okay with our um, with the jacket, yes. with the hat. But uh, <laughs> it was cold for hands. The more difficult one was uh, with hands right. and and the feet too. The feet. Yes. <laughs> yeah. But it was very very good, uh, and we have good moments between fans uh, and between uh, with Mika. Nice. Yeah. And. <laughs> Oh, and, and the gift, for, for anybody who doesn't know, what was the gift? Ah, oh, um, uh, comment tu dis montre, uh, Gugu? La montre? Uh, the Snoopy? Uh, watch? The watch? Yes, the watch. watch. Oh, my English, sorry. <laughs> uh, the a watch of, um, of Snoopy. A Snoopy swatch watch. Swatch watch. Sno yeah. Yeah. And um, for something for, um, for the dogs, for eating... Uh, Oh, for the dogs. Yes, okay. for the dogs. That's uh, an idea of Michel. Ah, nice. nice. But, uh, it was a nice idea. That's very cool. And um, and we have a, a little um, a carte. Carte. A card, uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. card. And uh, we can card. Appreci <laughs> appreciate, I think, because he posts uh, on the story. Yes, I did see that. So yeah. we, we went very, we was very happy. Yes, and it looked like he was wearing the watch in his yeah. story the other day. Yeah. So that was also nice, right? So that's very, very good. Yeah, <laughs> very nice. And um, for the, the concert, um, in there, uh, it was some uh, song, habitual song, as a relax, of course, <laughs> mm -hmm. and love today, of course, too. Uh, but there is um, there was two some uh, uh, songs that we heard not uh, fin, mm -hmm. not habitu uh, habituellement bref right um, popular song <laughs> uh, and uh, believe well, right yeah and 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 rain I guess he hasn't done yeah, rain. Rain. he hasn't rain. done rain very much it lately it was very very great rain yeah and. Happy ending for me is always uh, an emotion. Mm. I love always. relax, but happy ending is very, uh, very emotional. I think always. <laughs> yeah. Ah, so well, it looks like it was a nice concert. It was. Oh yeah. Uh, nice and long, so at least um, it made it worthwhile for you to go there, right? It wasn't just a short. A short concert. It was nice and long. So. No, it was long. And Mika said a lot of time he was happy to be there and to be with a lot of people because we we was a, a lot of people really. It was a huge crowd. Yeah, very huge, huge crowd. Yeah. So yeah, I saw the pictures and couldn't believe yeah. it. <laughs> it was very very cold, but very very good. <laughs> <laughs> Rose asks if he sang We Are Frozen instead of We Are Golden. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> yes. That's right. <laughs> yeah. Well, well, um, I'm glad that you had a good time. And I'm glad that you at least got to give the gift to him in person. That's always nice. Yes. Yeah. So you it know was that very he got it. Good Very good surprise. Yes. Yeah. So you know he received it. You don't have to wonder. And, and that's... Yeah. Uh, that was good. Yeah. That was very good. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for sharing with us. And uh, oh. I'm glad you had a good time. And, get, and that you got back safely. <laughs> yes. You, get, you did not get stuck <laughs> in another avalanche. <laughs> yes. <laughs> but for uh, the return, we changed the road. Ah, okay. <laughs> yeah. So went a different another way. Another road. Better. <laughs> a better road. That's good. <laughs> you learned your lesson. Good. Yeah. Uh, well, I'm glad.
<laughs> well, thank you so much. And I am going to uh, see if I can bring some other people in this way. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> we didn't, we didn't crash. So <laughs> yeah. Technology so was good. <laughs> so far, so far. So we will try to see if we can bring some other people in. Thank you so much. It was Thanks great to, to, you. Great to talk to you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye bye. We'll talk bye to bye. you again soon. <laughs> bye bye. Je t'aime, maman. Moi aussi, je t'aime. Okay. Yeah, so. Yeah, and I, I, like many of you have been saying um, in the comments, thank you to everybody who was there, who shared photos and videos. Um, it was great. For those of us who weren't there, it was really nice to, to see all of this and uh, uh, feel like we were a part of it. And especially the live streams, um, Camille, uh, when you started that, um, and Cerise, when you started your live streams, that was so great because it really felt very... Um, like I was there, immediate. Um, it was great. Um, <laughs> we need to sing for Angela. Happy birthday. Um, I, I am not going to sing. <laughs> but No, see, <laughs> she doesn't even want me to sing. So, um, yeah, let's see here. Um, I'm going to see if I can bring in a few other people. Um, I know, I think Ina wanted to, to talk with us about, um, about VARS as well. We'll see if we can bring her in here. Yes, Colm, yes. so excited. Hi, how are you? I'm good, thank you. Good. <laughs> Now it's a little bit more warm. <laughs> <laughs> yes, you're warm now. Yeah. Yes. Have you yes. recovered? Um, are you are you still tired from the trip, or have you recovered? No, oh, I I wasn't tired because uh, it was so so cool that uh, mm -hmm. uh, I was um, I my trip was uh, the day after to Bulgaria. I went to Italy, ah. and the day after I come back in Bulgaria, so I wasn't so tired. Here in Bulgaria, the weather is uh, almost the same, like in Bar. <laughs> <laughs> no difference. <laughs> When I landed, I, I saw the, the snow, so okay. <laughs> the adventure is uh, continuous. <laughs> oh, well. Yeah. Oh, Well, did did Gabriella want to, to join and, and and talk with you as well? Yes, uh, she she said me that uh, she can't uh, send the request. Uh, so if you can call her, let me see if I can. Um, well, I don't know. Let me see if I can bring her in. I I'm, I feel like if I brought. Let's see, I brought Gulden in. So let's see, Gabri. There she is. Let's see if this works. We'll see if this works. Ah, there it is. <laughs> there. Look, we're getting so <laughs> sophisticated <laughs> now. <laughs> Ciao, Gabriella. We're getting Ciao. so, so advanced now. Look at that. <laughs> so. Okay. So you guys had a really nice weekend as well, um, even yes. though yeah, yeah, yeah. For us, also it was difficult to to get there because it was the first time for for uh, Gabri to um, to drive with the snow. <laughs> oh my goodness! Yeah, and it's it, and it was a lot of snow. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> But, uh, It it was safety, and uh, we get there in time. <laughs> well, that's good. Yeah, I had yeah. heard. I had heard when everybody was making plans um, how difficult it looked like it was to get to, and yeah, I wondered if if some of you were going to have some uh, crazy adventures. So. Yes, it's only 150 kilometers from. Uh, Uh, I think from Turin, uh, it's 
150 but uh, it was um, the it was uh, the trip was three hours and half i think for oh, wow. uh, yes wow <laughs> yeah yeah and i don't really like to drive anyway but to drive in all that snow <laughs> yikes <laughs> For me, it's normal here. Uh, <laughs> here, nobody uh, take off the, the the snow, so I'm totally used to it, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, but it was worth it in the end, right? Yeah, yeah. It was uh, really cold, but uh, when uh, we saw Mika on the sound check, it the uh... cold. Is Disappeared. <laughs> Wonderful. Yes. <laughs> you forget everything, right? Yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I know and that feeling. Yeah. Like I said, it was really, really exciting to to give uh, Mika um, the the gift. Um, for me, it was the first time. <laughs> ah, yeah. Yes, we. Have two gifts one from all the the group and one from uh, me gabri and grazia right and uh, actually it was this ah, one this from us one. <laughs> and the red one was from all the group mm -hmm. yeah well it was nice that you were able to like i said to fanny it was nice that you could do it in person so you know yeah. who has it and um and you've yes. seen he's you've seen he's got it. He's using it. And yes, yes, it's, it's wonderful. Very cool. <laughs> yeah. Very cool. So, so um, after all of that, what was your favorite moment um, of the evening? Don't tell me it was when he took his shirt off. <laughs> oh, my favorite moment was um, um, all the concerts, <laughs> but. Um, I think when uh, uh, th there was uh, some uh, children um, uh, uh, in the first row. Okay. Uh, the, uh, I don't know the word uh, disabled. Disable yes. The word. Okay. Yes, and he uh, give uh, give them some uh, warmers from oh, his okay. glass. Yes, it was really, yeah. really cute, and uh, and of course when when he um, took our uh, cover, uh, I don't know the word this this golden. Uh, oh, the blanket. Uh, the, yeah. Blanket. Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. It was really, really nice. But he he took it. And it would have it would have been good for him, but then he didn't use it. <laughs> yep. Yeah. That's crazy. Yeah. But, but it was good. I'm glad. I'm glad that you could feel the energy and that many people. Um, it had to be amazing because we've had almost two years of being so isolated. Um, oh, yeah. It had to feel good to be almost normal again right yes and and also the um, the after concert was really uh fun <laughs> we we went to our apartment we was uh, 10 11 i i don't remember uh and uh, we we put some music we ah. eat something we drink uh, rum <laughs> ah. <laughs> that chased away that chased away all the cold <laughs> yeah yeah <laughs> well that's good well i'm glad you had such a good time and i really do i really do love when i see you know fans can get together like that from all over and and really enjoy not just me being together too so that that's very cool i'm glad I'm glad you, you guys went and I'm glad you made it back safely as well. So <laughs> I found I found another word <laughs> with that. Yeah. 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 I see they said they only had hot chocolate. 
<laughs> they, they <were. laughs> well, well, thank you guys very much. I appreciate it. And uh, I, lo I loved, uh, like I said, all the photos and videos that you uh, were posting and sharing with all of us. That really helped us feel connected. And uh, that was really appreciated. So thanks. And You're welcome. You're welcome. Yes. Yeah. See you in London. Yes. See you yes. in London, if not sooner. <laughs> it, we'll will be, it, it will be fast. <laughs> yeah. Let's hope. Let's hope the seven months goes quick. Yeah. So, yes. Well, take good care and uh, we'll talk to you all real soon. Okay. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Thank you. Ciao. Bye. Ciao. Ciao. Okay, whoops. Okay. There, okay. Yeah. Uh, I am um, so glad that uh, people were able to go there. I, I had heard how hard it was to get to, so I was worried that uh, we wouldn't um, hear anything about how the whole weekend went. I'm glad it worked out. So, um, yeah, so let's see. We're running low on time again, but maybe I can bring in one more person. Um, let's see here. Uh, Chloe? Let's see if we can bring Chloe in here. Maybe not. Hmm. Hello. Ah, there she is. Hi. How are you? Hi. I'm good. How are you, Deb? I am well. I'm well. So you've got your tickets. You're all ready for um, London. I am. Yeah. Oh, I'm so excited. Uh, I think the last time, I feel a bit bad, actually. The last time I saw him was Portugal, I think, many years ago now. Oh, so wow. yeah. <laughs> it's been that long. Yeah. So I'm really pleased. And I missed the London gig two years ago as well, and I was so gutted. Mm. So yeah well good well good and i'm glad that it i'm glad it worked um that the pre-sale went pretty smoothly i like i said we had a little bit of a a, a mix-up at the beginning um mm -hmm. but once we got the right link everything went smoothly and that was good so um i i understand that um they're selling pretty well the tickets are selling pretty well so i think they're expected to sell out that would be amazing yeah. right I really hope so. To be honest, I got mine at about th half three today. I was on the bus on the way back from work and I thought I'll just check if there was any tickets and I was standing and I thought, you know, I'm young enough to stand for a whole gig. So I won't book any of the seats sort of, <laughs> I think, you know, so. I checked right before I came on here and I think all of the seated area is, is gone or at least um, I, I don't know if they had opened all of it for the pre-sale, but there were, there were no more seats available in the, in the seated area um, for the pre-sale anyway. I don't know if there'll be any more released um, when they do the general sale. But uh, so I think, yeah, I think it's doing really well because we want it to do well so that he feels inspired to book more dates in the UK, right? <laughs> so. I don't understand. He's like obviously given out so many dates for America and then it's like one date and it was the same two years ago. And I remember saying to somebody like, why is it just one day? Like I couldn't go because it was midweek and I was so sad. I was like, great. Yeah. It doesn't really, you know, the people that really want to be there, like the originals, like me, <laughs> doesn't give you much choice. <laughs> but yeah, um, I actually... Um, what's really nice actually is I'm going to be seeing, I don't know if you know Jo, I think she might have been at Par Paris, but um, I saw her 12 years ago at the Eden Project and I haven't seen her since oh, then. Wow. So we're going to be meet in London and stand at the front of the gig, hopefully, and scream and shout like we were like, I don't know, 13 years old or 15 <laughs> years old. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah. That is yeah, awesome. yeah. I'm really looking forward to that. Oh, that's cool. Well, what I was yeah. going to say was, I think that um, the two years ago, when the Revelation tour got canceled, I I don't know for sure, but it seems to me like they alluded to the fact that there was going to be more dates 
um, that, right. that would have been more dates in the UK and other places, but obviously it just didn't happen. No. So it yeah. was, you know, a lost, a lost year. <laughs> so, but, um, yeah, that's right. Yeah. So, yeah. Well, we can hope. Like I said, if if this show sells well, maybe that'll be inspiration and and uh, motivation to to do more. <laughs> yeah, and like you, dedication. You always go to all the gigs and everything. I so yeah, I'll see you in. <laughs> <laughs> I don't. Though, but if he did more in the UK, and I'm like, if I'm over there for London, and he's doing more, for, I would definitely yeah. go. You know. Mm -hmm. so, yeah. yeah. But you're doing quite a few. Aren't like you doing three in America anyway? So that's quite good. I Dates. am, am going to try to do at least three. It's, it's a little bit, it's a little, the timing is not perfect because it's like the one date, is, the Brooklyn date is my son's 30th birthday. Oh. And I think he probably won't care because he probably won't want to see me on his birthday <laughs> anyway. He probably want to be with his friends, but I care. But yeah. And then it goes, um, I think the Toronto date is Good Friday. Um, so it's getting into the Easter, um, holiday there. So I don't know. Well, but I think it'll be all right. We'll, we'll work it out. And I would love to go to every date, but <laughs> as, yeah. as, as Fanny said, I think she said, I, I saw in the comments, her husband, she thinks her husband's ready for a divorce because of, and I, think, <laughs> I saw that. yeah, I think <laughs> I might be. <laughs> After all this yeah. time, you might have had it, you know. So, but anyway. Yeah. Well, I'll be coming to the London gig on my own. Before, because I was so young, my mum came with me to, like, Cornwall and Portugal and everything. But now it's the first gig I can feel like, you know, an actual adult. Well, <laughs> an adult, but a not-so-adult, because his, his music brings so much childhood back. I'm going to feel like a child again, but, you know, in an, in an adult's body now. So, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But it's um, but yeah. Right. it's good the nostalgia you maybe you uh, you could do uh, didn't you you were a lollipop girl at um one point weren't you didn't you um n no i no i wasn't i think oh. i wanted to be never got chosen but yeah yeah oh, oh well maybe he'll revive that and you can fulfill your old dream <laughs> <laughs> no i think that's dead and buried now deb i really do i don't think he'll do something more exciting i actually really like the name for his tour this time actually it's really nice yes um, so I'm hoping maybe his songs might be similar to to that, mm -hmm. I guess, because his other tours have been kind of very similar to the the music is you know written. So I'm hoping that that might be the it's case. True. But yeah, yeah, yeah. It is. It's always exciting when it's something new and and, and unknown, and uh, yeah, you like to speculate about what's going to happen. So, mm -hmm. Yes, I'm yeah. definitely excited oh. for it. So well, it was lovely to talk to you. Thank you so much. And I'm you so, too, Deb. And I'm I hope, so pleased. I hope I actually get to meet you in person, Linda, because I don't think I met you, did I, before? I know I've been on an active member on Mika Fan Club, but I don't think I ever, we've ever met, have we? I, I, you know, I don't know. I can't. If we did, it was in passing, and it was probably like you said, you were young, and you were with, your, with one of your parents or something. And so maybe it was just in, in passing, but because uh, I yeah. did. I did come to some of the UK gigs way back then, so, but, but maybe not, so. Did you go to the Birmingham gig when he did um, uh, the Boy Who Knew Too Much tour? I did not. I no. didn't go to Birmingham. No. So. Oh, because that was one of the ones that was, I guess, like, Portugal was a bit like a festival, and so was um, a little bit, like, Cornwall was an ish I mean it was outdoors mm -hmm. but I think you know the the boy who knew too much was an in, indoors one if you know what I mean so mm -hmm. it's a bit different right but yeah <laughs> right was yeah. Cornwall was Cornwall the one that was the Eden project was that the Cornwall yeah okay yeah no I didn't and Mika was so young like I have a, a video of him we, I mean there was just a group of us sat down you know what it's like before a gig anyway just sort of sat down taking in the moment waiting for him and he came on to a sound check and he just looked over and gave us like the most loveliest smile like he didn't expect anyone to be there mm -hmm. and I actually recorded at that moment and he was so young I mean his hair was you know what it's it, you know everybody's hair changes as we get older but it was just so just 
you know, he just looked so young and everything. <laughs> it was just such a nice moment. It was yeah. really nice. Uh, yeah. It's nice that you have that memory too. That's cool. Yeah. Lovely. Yeah. <laughs> well, well, hopefully we will get to make some new memories. Um, next yeah. Year. Can't wait. So yeah. Good yeah. to see you, Deb. Take yes. care. You too. Take good Bye. 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 Okay. And just like that, um, our hour is almost up. It's, it goes so fast. You know, when we had uh, the chance to go longer than an hour, it seemed like it, I don't know, it, it didn't go quite so quickly. But um, yeah, so I am going to just say, um, I will see you guys next week, um, probably on Tuesday and on Sunday for our Christmas Zoom. And we'll see what kind of fun things we can do for the Zoom and for the uh, Instagram Live to make it sort of festive and Christmas-ish and holiday-ish, New Year's-ish. And um, I hope you all can join us. I hope you all keep safe and well until then. And um, if you have any questions or any suggestions for this or any questions about the tour and the uh, ticket pre-sale, uh, always um, feel free to write me and um, yeah if you have any ideas for uh, what you might like to do next week for Christmas please uh, let me know and uh, thank you again um, and until next week keep safe I'll talk to you then bye I'm not really gone yet, am I? I can't, I can't uh, turn this off today. <laughs> Thank you all. Talk to you soon. Bye.